All right, this is for Pokemon Soul Silver. Session 24, we're starting the legendary journey. We're going to sync up for it in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, on the clap. Mmm, that clap, though. There we go. It's a French ass clap, Yvonne. My little croissant. My little croissant. All right, adventurers, welcome to All Play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke. Listen, I know we're not where we left off in our last episode, but that's for a very important reason. We got a lot of important things to do, and we had to come all the way back to Johto to do them. Now, before I get into today's episode, I want you to stay around at the end of the video. At the very end of the video, make sure you stick around for an important notice. There's something major happening, and I want to make sure that you know all the information that you need to know about it. Now, on to today's important business. Today, we need to go and find a couple of events that happen here in the land of Johto. Now, what we're going to do first, what we're going to do first, I'm pretty sure you can already tell based on today's, uh, today's thumbnail, today's title card. What we're going to do is fly to Violet City. We're going to fly to Violet City as our first action. Now that we're in Violet City, there's a special Pokemon that I have to go and grab out of the PC. I'll explain the rules behind this Pokemon after I get it out the PC. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Arceus. Arceus is an event Pokemon. It has a very special quality about it in that it is one of the Pokemon that unlocks certain events from happening within the game. Now, there's a couple rules around us using Arceus. We can use Arceus to unlock this event, but we cannot, I repeat, we cannot use Arceus in battle. This is what our team currently is. I put uh, Joy in the box. So Joy is being replaced by Arceus just for the time being. So really, if we can't use Arceus in battle, that means we really only have five Pokemon on the team. So the Nuzlocke rules still apply. If our entire team faints, we can't use them in battle. I'm sorry, if the entire team faints, game's over. We lose. Uh, so we have Arceus leading the team just for the sake of this event. Which event might this be? Uh, we have to leave the lovely, what is this, Violet City? We have to leave Violet City in order to activate this event. This event takes place in the Ruins of Alpha. It's an area that we did not visit uh, too much. We didn't spend too much time there. Uh, also, I've never seen this event. Like I said, it's an event Pokemon. Only so many people would be able to get this Pokemon. So what we're going to do is we're going to head to the Ruins of Alf. Uh, let's see. And we need to come to this building, I believe it is. Ouch! 
Are you okay? I was in a hurry and... Sorry, did I hurt you? No way! Could it be a Pokemon from Sinnoh? The one they call Arceus? Oh, could it be? Arceus is causing all this. I cannot explain any other way. Arceus may be the key to solving the mystery of the unknown and the ruins of Alf. Can you come to the ruins with me? Please, you must. I'm trembling with excitement. I think something is about to happen. Hmm. I have been studying the ruins for many years, but something feels different. Wow! The unknown pictures on the wall. It feels like they're staring at me. Oh, bear. Oh, bear. What is this? There is something eerie that is making my legs shiver. I can't stop them. Uh-oh. Where in God's green earth are... Oh, snap. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this madness? Uh, am I supposed to talk to you, Arceus? He seems to want to play with us. We've been transported to another world and, and Arceus wants to play with us. Well, hello. It's so freezing, isn't it? For a youngster like you to be interested in the Sinjo Ruins is not something we see every day. The Sinjo Ruins. Take a look at them. From the design of the pillars at the Sinjo Ruins, you can see that the cultures of Sinnoh and Johto have blended. What was I thinking? We don't need to be standing here. Why don't you come to the cabin around the corner for more discussion? Alright. Is that okay with you? He looked up at the sky and shouted loudly. I feel like that would make the sky fall. By the way, we happen to have a person at the cabin. Any trainer should know who she is. The famous trainer from Sinnoh. She is traveling around to study myths in ancient ruins. Isn't that something? Alright. Just let in the cabin, man. Look at this man, and this guy. A long time ago, people used to draw life from Pokemon and also give their lives to those Pokemon. That shows that people in Pokemon used to be more closely bonded with each other. When people move from place to place, the myths and legends of Pokemon and their power would also be carried with those people. That's how myths and legends from each other... Myths and legends from each other... Oh, from each region. I can't read. That's how myths and legends from each region are blended with each other. The ancient ruins here have inherited the legends from both the ruins of Alf and Johto and the Spear Pillar in Sinnoh. That is proof that people from Johto and Sinnoh blended together as a group. This guy knows a lot about history. Hey, look who this is. It's, uh, it's, uh, Cynthia from, from Sinnoh. My name is Cynthia. I am a Pokemon trainer. The Sinjo ruins remind me of Sinnoh, where I come from. Initially, I thought it was because it snows a lot here as well. But that was not it. A long time ago, people came from Sinnoh to live here. They must have built a temple here while longing for home. That's why we call these the Sinjo Ruins. You are a Pokemon trainer? I can sense strong power coming from your Pokeball. I feel a familiar presence. The power of Dialga, Palkia, or could it be Giratina? It's similar, but not quite the same. Have you got time? Can you come to the Sinjo Ruins with me? Call it a trainer's intuition. When you and your Pokemon step onto that stage, something will happen. I don't know, man. Nothing happened last time. Nothing happened last time. I feel as though if we talk to this man with his opera, we're going to go back home. Let's not do that. Let's not do that right now. All right. This is the mystery stage, the mythical stage built to show respect for Arceus. 
It is said that people used to celebrate its magnificent might with music and dance. Some people in Jilto still pass down that tradition. That would be the uh, Egritique Dance Theater, I believe. The mystery stage allows a single Arceus and nothing else to get on this stage. If you wish to go up there, you have to deposit your other Pokemon in a PC at the cabin. Oh, so we... It's not that we have to switch out a member to have Arceus on the team. It has to be that the only Pokemon on the team is Arceus. All right. We're going to have to put away Team Snaps of Claps for just a moment. Just a hot sec. Here we go. Let's go ahead and get this done. All right. Handle. The only Pokemon we have on the team with us right now is Arceus, this event Arceus. All right, she gonna say the same thing? According to the ancient document, time, space, and antimatter, or what combined we call the world, shall be born when Arceus stands on the mystery stage. This is where one might say, the lead enters the mystery stage at last. All my study of ruins and Pokemon mythology in Sinnoh may have been to bring you up on this stage here today. All right, here we go. Depicted on the mystery stage are the Pokemon that shape this world. The circle in the middle is Arceus, the origin of it all. This is the pattern that represents Palkia, the master of space and dimensions. This is the pattern that represents Dialga, the guardian of time. This is the pattern that represents Giratina, the ruler of the world that is on the opposite side of ours, the world of antimatter. Arceus has accepted you, uh, you as a trainer. Arceus, having shaped the world, is said, is said to show you a glimpse of its true power. The power of possibly making life appear out of nothing. It seems that something will happen when you choose one of the circles. You'll want to be well prepared. Alright, so we can get either Dialga, Palkia, or Giratina in the normal game. Remember, this is randomized, so we have no idea what we're going to get. But we only get one. We don't get to choose all three. Uh, for reasons for this playthrough and future playthroughs, I'm going to choose Giratina. We're going to go to Giratina's circle. So you choose Giratina, the ruler of the distortion world. Let's do it. It's the unknown. They're here. Bear. Oh, bear. It's Arceus. pictures. Break it. Oh. Hmm. 
mysterious round object to the shape of a Pokemon. We got a Dawn fan. <laughs> RC has created Dawn fan, the ruler of antimatter. We like to give a nickname to Dawn fan, of course. Do we actually have Giratina or Dawn fan? What are we gonna call this one? What are we gonna call this one? What do we get? Oh, oh, I got it. In, in either case, in either case, this is its name. I think this is how you spell it. I haven't had. Oh wait, is it? Is it this one? No, no, it's not a ph. It's it's a v. Okay, I was saying it wrong in my head. This is Vanta Black, either Vanta Black, the Giratina, or Vanta Black. The dog fair. I'm here for it. That shining spear. Could it be an egg? Did we just witness the very moment an egg was brought to this world? A moment no one has ever seen? An egg is the cradle of every being. The planet itself is an egg in a sense. The life that comes from an egg will come to an end in due course. To begin anew. That may be what Arceus wanted to show us. I think we need the GTFO. That was, we seem to be surrounded by that strong power again. Oh, are you all right? You disappeared right in front of me. I was so surprised. I see, the power of Arceus and Unknown affect each other to create a huge energy. we are sent you to the Sinjo ruins? Unknown, the ruins of Al. In Arceus, the mystery deepens. It has made me even more inquisitive. I will one day solve all the mysteries. All right, whatever, man. All right, this GTFO. I kind of don't want to check to see whether or not we have Giratina or Dawn fan until we get back to a PC, till we get to a box. I don't remember if they have a PC in there. I doubt it. So what we're going to do is we're just going to make a very quick cut, and we're going to be back at Violet City. All right, back at Violet City. Let's let's get Team Snaps and Claps back, and then we'll be ready to go. Let's see. Was this actually, was this actually a Giratina or no? Nope, wrong button. Let's see. Is it the move? It was a Giratina. Yo, we have a Giratina on the team. Oh, ignore this. <laughs> ignore that. That's for that's for a future thing. That's for. <laughs> It's for a future thing. We got a Giratina on the team. Let's check the stats. We can move it around. Let's check the stats. Ugh. Change the box. Gira Vanta Black the Giratina. She's lax nature, level one, and holding the grizziest orb. It knows dragon breath and scary face. It, it's supposed to be randomized. It's supposed to be completely randomized just like everything else. Turns out we actually got the Giratina. That's wild. Okay, so we can raise up Giratina and she'll be ready to go for uh, for a good old battle. A good old battle. All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's episode. If you enjoyed this episode and would love to see more of our legendary journey, all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. Now it's the subscribe button. And I'll do my best to make sure you guys can see more episodes of games like Pokemon Soul Silver, more challenges like Nuzlocke Runs, as well as everything else that Altplay has to offer. Thank you for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Altplay. We got a Giratina. All right, guys, the Pokemon Soul Silver playthrough is at the grand finale, and I want to do something special. I don't know if you know this or not, but we've been doing streams weekly. Uh, every Saturday night I can guarantee a stream And then I do streams throughout the week uh, As I have the availability As I have the time to do so Well for the end of Soul Silver, For the grand finale For the last battle I would like to stream that I would like it to go live on the channel uh, Before we actually release it as an episode And I'd like for you guys to be there while it's recording So if you take a look at the schedule here This is my upcoming schedule for streams As we have it and now I would like to go ahead and add in Soul Silver to the mix. The Soul Silver Grand Finale Last Battle will be taking place at this date here. I hope you guys can tune into the stream, and don't worry if you can't make it to the stream. It will be uploaded to the channel as a regular episode, just like the rest of uh, the Soul Silver playthrough. 
Uh, thank you very much to everybody who has checked out the Soul Silver playthrough. Thank you to everyone who's planning on making it to the stream. And don't worry, once again, if you can't make it to the stream, it will be uploaded. The only difference is you won't see it live as it's happening. Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on All Play.